up guys, Hong Nguyen, OG Fitness. You guys know what time it is. Well, sent me a question on, uh, by email, sorry. I have proposal for next movie. <laughs> movie, okay, all right, cool, cool. Uh, I saw some guys which had base of Japanese Jiu Jitsu on judo class, which were normal gi. It was problem for, for me to grab and throw, for instance, how to buy and detail how size should be correct. Uh, washing gi, uh, judo gi, etc, etc. Hey, thanks for the question, uh, Powell. You know, it's funny, but my first gi, when I got one, when I started uh, Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, I didn't buy a Brazilian Jiu Jitsu gi. I bought a Japanese Jiu Jitsu gi, but it wasn't uh, sturdy enough and it ripped and then I sewed it back and I used it for a little while more. Then after that, I got a couple more gis for Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. I went over to do judo and I used my Brazilian Jiu Jitsu gi uh, for, for a little bit, but then after that I bought myself a real uh, judo gi. Japanese Jiu Jitsu gi is really thin, right? Uh, compared to a judo gi. It's not gonna last. All the, all the pulling and tugging on it and then all the uh, constant washing, after like a year or two, it's probably gonna rip the more you use it. With a Brazilian Jiu Jitsu gi, it's, it's much sturdier, right? It's still really thin. So if you use a Jiu Jitsu gi when you do judo, then the judoka who's gonna grab you He's gonna have a very easy time uh, grabbing you and not letting go. I believe that if you, uh, if you wanna do judo, then get yourself a, a judo gi. If you wanna wash a judo gi, guys, you gotta wash it uh, in cold water and don't dry it. Because if you dry it, it's gonna shrink. If you wash it in hot water, it's gonna shrink. Already in cold water, it's gonna shrink a little bit. Different gis will react very differently if it was pre-shrunk or whatnot. So you gotta be careful about that. And, and judo gis are, are, are not fitted, guys. Okay, like jujitsu gis, they're thinner, they're sturdy, and they're nice and fitted. So it's nice and like tight, you know, you wear it, you look like you're wearing a, a, a custom design fitted suit, you know, whereas a judo gi, it's like a sack of potatoes. And that's the way it's made. It's made that way so that we could grab each other and then we could throw each other. I'm going to link a video uh, by, uh, by Jimmy Pedro, and this video really explains uh, the dimensions, the size, and everything. And so I, I rather just link that video to you. My judo gi, right, like I, I bought it, it's a big sack of potato, and then I washed it in cold water, and it didn't shrink at all. And then from there, I'm like, okay, you know what? Like this thing is kind of big already, so I'm gonna like um, dry it in the dryer, and it didn't shrink. And now like that gi, I wash it, and I, I, I wash it in hot water, and I dry it. It's still a sack of potato. So, but you know, like I wouldn't recommend that doing right off the bat when you get a gi. Well, the thing with a, a guy who has a, he's wearing a, uh, let's say G, a BJJ gi, then of course grabbing their sleeve here is gonna be harder because it's fitted, it's so thin. I mean, it's so tight. I can grab the lapel easily, right? Cause it's nice and soft and thin. So grab that right there, grab them here, grab them here, whatever. That's where it gets wonderful, right? Because, because their gi is so uh, thin, you can literally just put your arm on their back and just just grab it all up like that. Watch that video. I'm gonna put it in. Uh, I'm gonna put a link below so that you could check it out. And uh, yeah, that's it, guys. So thank you very much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. So thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and click on the notification bell. Also, there's a link down below. If you guys click on it, it's gonna bring you to a page where you could follow me on all my social media platforms. And you can also apply for, uh, for coaching so that you guys can work directly with me. Also, one last thing guys, if you have any questions, right, send me an email. That's the best way to reach me. I read them and I'll, I'll answer your, your questions, man. All right, peace.